Welcome, family, friends, and loved ones. We gather here today to celebrate the wedding of Kelly and Steve. I could live a thousand lives. You have known each other from the first glance of acquaintance at Amalfi's restaurant to this point of commitment. Winter's cold to the summer skies. After today, you, you shall say to the world, right by my side. this is my husband, this is my wife. If the heavens rearrange the stars. Kelly, when I first saw you, I had to find my way into your heart. And when the time came for our first date, you absolutely destroyed me at basketball. <laughs> Steve, as I stand here in front of you, our family and closest friends, I could not be happier and feel more at ease that I have found my forever person. From the moment I met you, I knew that you had to be mine. When Kelly first asked me to be your maid of honor, I had to laugh. Not because I was surprised or confused, but rather I couldn't believe my K-Shell, my Afro-loving, sport-playing, pigtail-braid-wearing BFF from the fourth grade was getting married, and that 20 years later, she still wanted me to be by her side. <laughs> Growing up, Kelly and I often joke that we were each other's person. The Christina Yang to her Meredith Grey, the Monica to her Rachel. We understood each other perfectly and were pretty much inseparable. Steve, over the last few years, you've quickly become Kelly's new person and I couldn't be happier. We are here today to join Kelly and Steve in marriage. Now take a moment, forget all the stress of planning this day, and simply enjoy your friends and family who have gathered to spend this day with you. Take time today to think about how each person has touched your life and why they are here with you today. Steve and I met freshman year of high school through the ice hockey team. We've done a lot, we've been through a lot. We're always gonna be here for both of you. Also, you are the only girl he ever said, I'm gonna marry this girl. I have no doubt about this whatsoever. I give you this ring as a daily reminder as my love for you. I give you this ring as my daily reminder for my love for you. By my side. Kelly, you look absolutely beautiful tonight. And Steve, I hope you know just how lucky you are. While I will always be a phone call, text, or FaceTime away, I know that together you two will celebrate the highs and lows of life and navigate anything thrown at you, just like Kelly and I have done for each other. So tonight I ask everyone to not only celebrate my person, but now my people. I must say, this wasn't my first choice. My first choice was barbecue in the backyard, beer truck in the front, cornhole, <laughs> selfie sticks for pictures. Yeah, we don't need the photographers, you know. And Kelly says to me, Dad, I'm your only daughter. Don't go cheap on me. I know everyone here, you know, is wishing for two things right now. The first, that I shut up. And the second, just a long, happy, wonderful marriage for these two wonderful kids. Many people have asked me throughout the entire engagement if I was nervous. I was never nervous. I knew you were the one for me. I vowed to be the best for you, no matter the conditions. Oh, I love it. We made it through a lockdown, COVID-19, in a one-bedroom apartment. <laughs> we made it, and I couldn't be prouder of us. And in bad times, we persevere, but in good times, we cherish. With those words, I can say that I promise to ensure the good times become the best and learn and grow from the bad. 
You've been a rock for me, and there's nothing more that I could ask of you. I love you always and forever. Steve, you are kind, genuine, outgoing, smart, thoughtful, hardworking, maybe a little funny, but just not as funny as me. <laughs> the qualities are endless. <laughs> In our marriage, I promise to be there for you. I promise to support you. I promise to love you unconditionally. I promise to root for the Dallas Cowboys because being a New York Jets fan, well, you know how that goes. No matter the different sports and the teams that we root for, you and I are my favorite. You are my best friend and one true love. There's still a part of me today that cannot believe, sorry, <laughs> that I'm the one that gets to marry you. <laughs> I love you forever. By the power vested in me by the state of New Jersey, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Kelly and Steve, you may kiss each other.